Northside neighborhood. And that is not all. Plans are in the works to give new life to an empty building. WMTW News 8's Megan Torgerson takes us to the site of the proposed development in tonight's Your Money. We're here in the Old Century Tire Building, a marginal way in Portland. Doesn't look like very much right now, but there are big plans on the horizon for this space. Tell us, tell us what's in the future for this Old Century Tire Building. Well, there are two buildings here on uh, this site and one across the street. We're going to be renovating all three. Uh, the building that we're standing in, the back building, is going to be uh, reduced in size by about two thirds. The front building we're going to enlarge by about 40 percent. And we've got two tenants uh, that have letters of intent that have been signed. We have about 8,000 square feet. On this site, that we're talking with local and national tenants to to re release the rest of it, and the back building is about 2,000 square feet. We've got a local tenant that we're talking with about that as well. So, what does this kind of development mean for the Bayside community here in Portland? Um, well, we've talked with a lot of uh, some of the uh, office workers, um, pe people who live in the student housing uh, down the street, and there is not a lot of uh, food options. So I know, number one, Chipotle is excited to be here uh, just to provide another option. I think this end of, of Marginal Way hasn't seen the uh, development that the other side, the east side, has. So I think this hopefully will provide um, services that will entice housing developers and, and other office tenants to want to be in this area. And what's the timeline? What are we talking? We will start construction in April. Our plan is to submit to the city at the end of this month, early February, uh, our full plans. Um, and then April construction finishing in about January. Tenants will then do their fit up. Uh, and I would expect the first tenants to open up uh, spring of 2016. Okay, so look for the changes and the new tenants in the spring of 2016. For your money, I'm Megan Torches.